Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to our channel. If you don't know who I am, my name is Brendan and I'm an outdoor travel photographer. And today I'm gonna to be showing you what's in our bag. So as you can tell, uh, Megan's actually not here today. Aww. It's just me and I'm gonna be showing you guys what we carry in our bag. Uh, mostly me, I carry most of the gear, but Megan does carry a few things for me as my bag gets so heavy. So yeah, let's get into it. So first off, this is my bag. It, yeah, it's, it's massive. It doesn't even fit on the screen right now, but this is it. Um, this is the Peak Design 45 liter travel bag. Um, I've tried so many bags and this is the one I choose. I love it. It's very well made. It's big. It fits everything I need. And so basically what I carry on daily is a water bottle. This one's by Havana. Um, I'm going to be linking everything in the description below. So if you have any questions or like that, I can answer them. But most of the things that will be in this video will be linked below. Um, but I'm going to open this thing up and show you guys what I carry. So the first thing I'm going to show you guys in my bag is actually this MacBook Pro. It is the 16 inch version 2019. Um, I love it. I've been, I've had it since it came out. Really nice laptop. My workhorse is basically um, spec'd out to the max. But I also carry an iPad with me, especially when I'm traveling internationally. I love having Netflix and being able to watch videos on it. So iPad, this is the 11 inch version, iPad Pro. I believe it's the 2019 version. It's the old camera on the back. Um, but yeah, I carry those two in my bag always. So in my Peak Design bag, I actually carry this Peak Design uh, camera cube. It's a medium sized one, um, so it fits in my bag nice and I still have room to put other stuff. Um, but basically I have a 7200 Canon RF lens. Um, I love this thing. This thing is awesome for compressed photos. I use it not all the time, but it's always great to have in your bag. And then I have, actually this is a kit lens, probably the best kit lens you can get. So if you're new and you want to get a mirrorless, I would suggest buying a Canon USR. And then the kit lens of 24 to 105. It's a F4, but this thing is so sharp. Um, I recommend it to any beginner or anyone. I actually carry it in my bag, so um, I love this lens. And then picture not here is actually a Canon USR that I'm filming on right now, um, along with a 15 to 35 RF 2.8. That's basically my workhorse. I use that camera and lens for about 90% of my photos. So yeah, I love that camera, it's great. It's um, held up over the years since I've had it. I recommend. So what else is in here? Camera strap. I have some batteries in here. I carry about four batteries with me because you never want to be left out in the field without enough batteries. So I got batteries, um, a random cord. I got some polarizers here. I just got off Amazon, I can link those below as well. And then I have, these, believe it or not, is what I carry all my photos on. Yeah, I carry all my photos on these things. They're so small, so tiny, super light. I just switched these last year. They're SSDs and I highly recommend. These are both a two terabyte version. So I have four terabytes with me at all times. This is just a uh, SD holder. So I got my nice uh, SD cards in there. Keeps them nice and safe. It's hard and I can just throw it around. So I like having this. I have my MacBook charger right here. So that's pretty much the main compartment of my bag, just to show you guys quickly what the inside looks like. That's how big it is, and my camera cube fits right here, which is really nice, and then I have a bunch of space up here. So in the upper part of my bag, I actually have this. It's an extension cord with multiple plugs. This is great for when you're traveling with a bunch of people. Especially with Megan, we use this every time we travel. Plug it in, we can plug all our things in and charge them which is always handy. And then, like I said, if you're with a group of people, you guys can share and it's really convenient. So I have that. This thing I love. I'm so, I'm so organized when it comes to my bag, but this is a Peak Design tech pouch. Um, I highly recommend this. If you hate cables everywhere, this thing will manage all your cables and more. Yeah, it's just basically, these are all my cords. I have a dual charger, which I also recommend for any photographer, is having a charger that will charge more than one battery at once. So I have this, really cheap off Amazon. And then also for travel, I always have a fast charger because you know your phone dies, camera batteries die, and you just plug this in and it charges things way faster. I also carry this uh, portable charger for my phone. It's really great while traveling. It charges it really fast. I think it's like an 18 watt charger on this thing and it charges my phone really quickly. So I always have this on hand. And then the rest is just a bunch of you know random cords. The one thing that I do also carry that I get asked about all the time is this Peak Design clip. I'll kind of show a clip right now of what it is, but it's basically a clip that goes onto your um, shoulder strap and you can put your camera on it. I use it for vlogging. 
I use it for hiking especially. I love being able to just grab my camera off my chest here and be able to shoot photos. It's really convenient and I highly recommend it. But yeah, so that's pretty much everything in my bag. I think the only things I didn't include were a tripod. Sometimes I also like to bring a tripod with me, but like 90% of the time I don't bring one. And then my last um, piece of gear that I carry with me, actually with us, with Megan, is this drone that we actually just bought. And Megan is gonna be carrying this for me because my bag is just getting way too heavy. But this is the Air 2S. I actually flew it recently just to test it out and I cannot believe how amazing this thing is. It's pretty much a Mavic Pro 2 in a smaller package and cheaper. So I highly recommend you guys check this out. And yeah, that's pretty much everything I have in my bag or in our bag, I should say. But yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this little breakdown of what we carry in our bags. So if you have questions about any of the gear I carry, or Megan carries, just let us know below and we'll try to answer them best as we can. Again, thank you guys for stopping by and watching what me and Megan carry in our bag and we'll see you next time.